little skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here, and like I said about a couple days ago, I have no makeup on because of some rushed filming that I am doing right now at the time of recording this, but um, you guys can't see it, but on my laptop right now I have a huge pile of papers. Now why do I have a huge pile of papers? Well, if you guys remember months and months and months ago, I made a video called a video I couldn't upload, and that was a video referring to when I put all of... I was like updating mine in hubby's um, adventure book. Well, that video, unfortunately I was filming it, well I was editing it with um, Windows Movie Maker, which crashed on me, which is why I have Fil Filmoria, which I'll talk about in a Chatting Skeletons episode, episode at some point. Um, so now that I actually have the time to, I'm going to, as I said, fix the scrapbook because this, it was bulky. Like literally, this is what it looks like right now. It's not too bulky, but it's still kind of bulky because we have some stuff in there. But it was like, like lifting till here. And it was all because of these guys. Our stupid, well not stupid, but our doodles from uh, the, Imagina the Animation Academy. So I had an idea to literally cut out the pictures that were drawn and then write on the bottom who drew them. Some of these are still taped. So I'll kind of go through these with you one by one. I should also probably get a pen for this. Be right back. All right, I got a pen for this. <laughs> I'm gonna pop the cap open so that way. Okay, so one thing we're also gonna be adding back in here because for some reason it didn't tape down well and I don't know why. And I need to retape this. I'm probably gonna be retaping a lot of things as I go along as well which I hope this tape can hold up. If not, Hubby's gonna run an errand and get me more tape. So where's our first blank page? Back here. Okay, so I, I have titles for these pages, or at least I did, but that's kind of not gonna be that anymore. So the first one we're doing is my sketch of Mickey. <gasps> so cute. There's gonna be a lot of recycling going on here. Can tell you that much. All the trash up at the end of this. Okay, so the thing that I have to put in here that we're gonna retape is actually gonna be later. So let's see what this one is. I have a lot of these to go through. Oh my god, this is gonna be a fun video to edit. Oh, this is um, Hubby's Oogie. I think for the bigger pictures like these, I may take him up on the idea of maybe getting a separate binder or a box, especially because I can't cut up these bigger pictures. It'd be nearly impossible to fit them on here, so do, 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 do. I think what we'll do is just keep these off to the side for now. Figure out what we're gonna do with them. I may like get a binder and put them in a binder. That could work. So let's see. We'll put those over there. So let's get the one that's hiding over here. I don't know why that one's hiding. Oh, this is my really horrible drawing of Goofy that I I can actually put in there. Oh, let me write down that I did. Okay, next is Hubby's version of Huey, Louie, and Dewey. So let's see, will that fit? That should fit. Uh, let's see if I can find like a more blank page to put this on. This seems pretty big. Uh, no, hang on. So I can find a better page to put this on. Ooh, that page should work. Okay, haha, -ha, it fits. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the original page I had left off on, because the plan is to fill up all these pages as best as I can. Wow, this thing is worse for wear. Okay, let's try this one up here. Get the pile done. Oh, that's my Daisy! She's super small, I can fit her on this page. Just to get, let you guys know, these are not to be perfect cuts. I am literally just cutting these out. And then on the same page, because for some reason, this particular object I had put in the memory book was falling out. I'll show you guys in a second. This was mine and hubby's first, um, they were our first promise rings, and they kind of fused together, if you can kind of see right there. They kind of fused together, and I put them in here and they just decided not to stick so we're gonna make them stick this time that is too short a piece but you know what that's okay i'll just kind of do that stick okay and then i'll do another little short piece right stick it right there 
Now, hopefully, it should stick. You know what? Let's do another piece just to be on the safe side. There and stick there. Perfect. Now it should stay in place. What's this one from the pile? Whoop! That one had a friend. <laughs> okay. Oh, this one is Hubby's Piglet. It's another kind of big one. I think I'm going to have to find a page for that one. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I could do this page. Let's see. Let me cut. That should fit. Yeah. I've been pretty good with guesstimating. I think the only one we'd really have to do something with is the Oogie one. Which I could, in all honesty, just put it up on the wall. Or I could keep it in my shrine. One of the two. Woo! I am so good at guesstimating. That fits. Definitely once I fill up these pages, I'm going to get a new memory book because this one is falling apart. <gasps> oh no. Oh, that's Hubby's Pooh Bear. That one turned out really cute too. And again, I'm going to have to find another big page for this one. I don't think it'll fit there. That could work. I think this would work maybe a bit better though. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I may have to do its own separate page, which is fine. We haven't filled up these pages in a while and I'd rather get them filled up anyways. Random stuff, I title these pages. At this point, the titles are getting so lazy. There's gonna be a lot of trash to throw away by the end of this. Ooh, that just barely fits. It's actually a good thing I gave it its own page, because if I didn't, it would not fit anywhere else. I'm gonna lose my pen in this mess. Well, I've already lost my pen a couple times in this mess. Okay, this is actually going by a lot faster than I thought it would, because when I added these, the whole video unedited was like an hour, almost an hour when I added these. This was mine. You know what, I think I'm definitely gonna put these on the wall. That, that's my Oogie one. And I think I'm gonna definitely put those on the wall instead of like in a binder because I think kind of like maybe we should frame them or something. That's my knockoff Remy. He looks bootlegged. <laughs> it's funny cause I had said time and time again that I drew a rat that clearly wasn't Remy, but he still looked very familiar to me for some reason. I don't know, just couldn't put my finger on it. If you guys know where he's from, and I'm just downright stupid, let me know in the comment section down below. Can you work with me here, buddy? Whoever you are, maybe one of the mice from Cinderella. Let's see, where can I... Ooh, you're gonna have to have your own page too, I guess. Wow, some of these are bigger than I thought they'd be. Gotta find more small ones to put in here. But that's kind of a problem because I have a bunch of space where these used to be that need to be filled and I need to fill them with something. Hubby suggested I write sweet sweet things. I might, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I just kinda wanted to get this done because, you know, it was main priority, something I've been needing to do. Oh, there's Hubby's Remy. Yay! Yeah, it's just something I had been meaning to do and I never got around to it so I figured I'd get around to it today while I could. Plus, I mean, as you guys know, I write down my, my video ideas because if I don't, I'm going to forget them. So I wrote this one down a while ago and just never got to it. And I figured I'd finally do that. And I'm not going to label these pages anymore. I've given up labeling. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Throw this pile over here. Oh, this is my jack. Yeah, that, that my jack one is definitely getting hung up. That That's, uh, yeah, that's going to get hung up. Oh, that's my sort of Pluto. <laughs> I say sort of because he doesn't look like Pluto. He looks like a potato with spaghetti ears. But then again, that's just kind of how my drawings go. The one I was most proud of, other than um, my piglet, well, even then I wasn't so proud of my piglet because the ears looked so wonky. My Eeyore was my favorite, and I think I either threw that one away or I gave it to somebody. Pretty sure I gave it to somebody. Okay, my knockoff Pluto that looks like a potato with spaghetti ears. I'm not gonna find any small ones, am I? Just means there's more space to fill up with more memories. <laughs> I can't even turn the pages. <laughs> there we go. Why did, I feel like the pile, like it's getting smaller, but I feel like at the same time, the pile is getting bigger. There's my piglet that I'm like semi proud of, but this ear turned out super weird. It looks like a rejected Dorito. Or maybe a way too flamboyant Frito. Or maybe like one of those like bugles, ones that you put on your finger and you feel like a witch. Ah! 
I cut off his ear. Nah, it's okay. Who's gonna miss his ear anyways? Let me see if this thing will fit on maybe any of the other pages. Because you never know. It could. It very well could. And I'm just not giving it enough credit. Uh, well, definitely not that page, but I do need to retape something on that page. So let's fix that. I gotta keep this position, so hopefully I can do tape with one hand. I can't do tape with one hand. I'll just put tape with the face. Like that. And that. Holy crap, it fits. Huh? Okay. Next one. Doesn't want to be opened, evidently. Oh, this one's my Tigger. That one's kind of big. It does kind of take up the whole page. You know what? I'll leave that one on the side, figure out what I want to do with it. That's my hay hay! That one's small enough. I, I can cut out the hay hay. I will admit, I wasn't exactly proud of my Tigger. So I don't know, I maybe might, I might toss it. Or I could, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to keep that one. It's not one that I was very proud of. And I really only kept it because Hubby kept his. I feel like once, when, like when uh, the parks open back up and we end up going back, my drawing skills are gonna be at uh, zero. <laughs> I swear we're gonna be showing our kids this book and one of these days when we open it, it's just gonna fall apart. <laughs> and then I'm gonna have to like completely redo it. And I'll make another video for that. <laughs> That's another Jack Skellington drawing I did. So that one, that one's smaller. I think I can put that one in here. Would that actually fit? If I really tried. Yeah, it would fit and just have to be on its own page. So that one I will put in here. Although I did my signature like stupid big because I was, it's Jack. I mean, how, why I'm like, I'm going to do it stupid big. This one it looks actually kind of nice. I gave him like a little swirly smile. You definitely are not going to fit there without covering some shit up. So next page. No, no. Like I said, you may need your own page. Ah! Man, some of this shit's already falling out. Solution, more tape. Yeah, you're not gonna fit there either. Or there, or there. Yeah, I think you're gonna need your own page. Which is fine. Okie dokie. Perfect. You did need a whole page of your own. It's funny, I'm signing so many of these, I feel like I'm like doing autographs for my non-existent fans. Well, I mean, they're, they're, I have fans, just not like some of the other YouTubers out there, which is fine. Okay, whose is this? Oh, this one's torn to shit. Oh, that's Hubby's Hey Hey with the word DARP next to it. Oh, yes! <laughs> Pardon my excessive singing. Oh, there's one back here. Oh, that's right. Okay. Oh, let's do this one over here. Wow, the pile's actually getting smaller. Holy crap, that's awesome. And I think editing's gonna be easily easy. Because you guys know I cut out my silences and I'm not talking much, so. Is that my other Pluto? That's my other Pluto. Who looks just as much like spaghetti and is just as huge. I may or may not. I'm gonna put this one to the side because, again, it takes up the whole page. I'm gonna figure out what I want to do with it. I don't think I'm necessarily gonna hang it up. But I don't, I mean, I may, again, I may toss it just because I didn't like how it turned out. Plus, I already have a Pluto drawing anyways. Oh, this is Hubby's Jack. <gasps> it's so cute, it looks chibi. Does chibi Jack fit here? <gasps> chibi Jack does fit here, kinda. Hang on, if I just kind of scoot him over. Chibi Jack fits! Ah! Well, eh, you know what? I'll take it. Chibi Jack fits. Okie dokie, let's hope I have one small enough to fit one of these little sections. Might be one of, one of mine. Mine usually turn out tiny. Oh, that's Happy's Daisy. She may need her own page. She's not too big, so she'll actually fit. Kind of figured she wouldn't fit there. That's got to be like a teeny drawing I got to put there. Will she fit here? <gasps> she do. Good. Filling up all the pages quite nicely. So let's go back to that tiny one. See if I can find a tiny one to fit there. <gasps> I'd be so happy. Okay. Let's do this one. Ooh, we only have one, two, three, four, five more, looks like, and then a couple of other papers that I could probably shrink. Ooh, my Pooh Bear is huge. It's it's huge. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that off to the side. You know what? I might frame those and give them to Harley Baby's hubby. Or to Harley Baby. That's hubby's Mickey. Which 
It's big. It's, it's big. It's too big. That one, that one will definitely put in a binder or something. How did this fold? There we go. I think. No, wait. Why does it fold like that? Okay, that's my other daisy. She's small enough, so I can put her with the small portion. Yeah, ta ta ta! She fits. Okay. Tiny signature. That's my mini! <gasps> She's so cute! That one's definitely small enough to go in here. So let's trim her out of there. I don't know why I drew her up so high. Then again, I don't I don't think I have any perception of space. I also don't have uh, much. I think it's called depth perception. Because when I park, I tend to over or underestimate how far my car is away from something. <sighs> uh, you know what? That, that works. You fit. Okay. I just had to find the right angle. Like a puzzle. Okay. One more. Woo. Well, my signatures are getting lazier. Okay. Well, might not be the last one because this might be one. And then I have two other papers to do. Oh, that's Hubby's Daisy. She's actually not too, too big, so I could fit her in here. She may just need her own page, though, which is 150% okay with me. Hubby's Daisy's gonna go there. Ah, oh, that's Hubby's Pluto. Looks so cute. I think that one actually might be a smidgen too big. Yeah, so we'll keep that one for a binder. And it's not to say that I'm, like, too lazy that I don't want to do this. It is, it's legitimately big. Okay, what are these? As I dropped one. <laughs> oh, that was our magical expressway. Okay, I'll definitely kind of cut around this. That way we can fit it. Unless I kind of just fold it like that. That wouldn't be too bulky, would it? Kind of did that. I don't know what the point of this isn't to fold stuff. But you know what? That actually works, and it's not bulky. It's a thin sheet of paper. And we can still open it up and see what it is, because I kind of folded it to where the flaps are open. Openable? Openable. That's a word. No, it's not. What's this? Woo! Oh, uh, this is our flight information. I think what I'll do is kind of do the same thing I did with the other one. Just fold it to where it's openable. So I'll have this go on its own page. And then, and then, and then, this one I can actually cut because it's tiny. Oh my god, I can see my laptop! Okay, so this one I can fold, same way I've been folding them. That, and that should fit right there. <gasps> it do! Oh my god, y'all, this looks so much nicer than when I originally had it. And it is five times smaller. Woohoo! Look at that, still kind of a little chunky, but not as chunky as last time. Holy crap, I can't believe I actually got that done. So without editing, this took about 36 minutes to do. So I'm actually very, very happy about that. With editing, uh, it'll probably be down to about a half hour, maybe like 25 minutes, depending on how much I actually cut out of this. But I thank y'all so much for watching. I'm not going to show you like the insides of the book just because it'll be too much of a hassle to like turn the pages and stuff. But maybe, but maybe one of these days I can like post pictures of what's inside on my Instagram. That way you guys can still kind of see it. But anyways, I thank y'all so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Bye little skeletons. Stay safe. And I love you guys.